Ayu, ¿cómo están? Hello. Okay, we are back with episode two of season six of Supergirl. I'm very excited to see what's gonna happen now. Where is, well, we know where Kara is, but what's gonna happen to her in the Phantom Zone. I'm very excited to see that and what, how they are gonna deal with that in the, the group of people. Like, how, what are they gonna do to bring her back if you are planning something? I don't know. I can't wait to see how this is gonna continue, so I don't wanna talk too much and just get started with it. So. Let's do it, let's go. Is he a vampire? What? This is going to suck for you. <laughs> suck for you. <laughs> what the hell? Not really a vampire. We know. Your name is Silas. You're an alien. From Transylvania, to be exact. Which is apparently a real planet. Oh, interesting. Great. We want you to help us break into the Phantom Zone. Why in the hell would you want to do that? Well, how is he gonna help? How, does he have any power to do that? You're the only person to ever break into the Phantom Zone. Mm -hmm. We need you to teach us how. You must understand I failed. And you will fail too. People talk about the Zone as a place where time does not pass. But that isn't what makes it terrible. It's the creatures that give it its name. Your nightmare becomes your reality. Okay, so they're gonna do that to Kara, I guess, and that will That's when you go insane. Okay. Just like my husband did. Supergirl is there. We're trusting you with this information because you're the only one who can help. And we think you're the kind of guy who would prove us right. Help us. Okay. I need a pen. Good man. <laughs> Courthouse is on lockdown due to threats against Luther. I mean, they're even keeping the jury off site to protect them. Well, the two of you are sharks. We'll find a way to get in. Plus, if you run into trouble, I'm sure Supergirl will swoop in to protect you. She always does. She's not here. Oh, God. And you need to train. And every day you spend fruitlessly shaking your fist at the sky is another day the Luther name gets dragged through the mud. Mother, it almost feels as if you care more about the family name than freeing your son from bondage. I do. Our family Just has always achieved selfish aims by appearing selfless. If you take the stand <laughs> and make a mockery right. of yourself, I will remind you I have been in prison before. I have been shot and killed and risen from the dead before, and I will not be subjugated again. You should know I always have a plan. Yeah, boss. Completely. A legal plan, imbecile. <laughs> well, let's hope this plan is better than the last. I'm scared now, because he's not going to be in prison for too long. Who are you? As if you don't know. You bear the glyph of my house. So you must be some sort of mirage. Another figment of my own tortured mind. Your house? This is the glyph of the House of El. Who's that? Father? Her dad? Kara. My daughter alive. My wife alive. Argo survived because of your sacrifice. Sending myself here was a last ditch attempt to save my life. I'll tell us. There are things worse than death. We are trapped here forever. We will never die. But we may yet survive. You must accept that, Kara, or you will go mad. Are you watching the trial? Oh, oh yes, I, I need this friendship back, please. the world please. to see my brother as he really is. Or well, what about who you are? Think of the good it could do if you aired your first-hand experience and asked for forgiveness publicly. I thought I was coming here to catch up with a friend, but you're lobbying for an interview. Oh. Please, Lena, I I screwed up with Obsidian. And Catco barely survived. It's all I have left. I'm in some bad shape. If you go on the record, maybe we can help each other. No, sorry for your troubles. I really am. But what happened by Lex's side, I will never speak of publicly. I thought maybe we could talk about it, especially after everything we've been through. But I see now that I was mistaken. Because as ever, you're always putting yourself first. Keep the scotch. Oh, no! 
I mean, I understand so, Andrea, oh, but that wasn't the best way yeah, of starting Cyrus's this conversation. help and then Andrea has to rebuild it, he can have Supergirl back by sundown. Well, by sundown? We should order in Dim Sum Delight's entire stock of pot stickers because she's going to be starving when she gets back. You're not listening to me. Sundown is impossible. So it's going to take time. Okay. Hey, look, I know you're scared, but you can do this. You can build that portal. You can make it work. And when you do, we will save Supergirl. And every life she saves from then on will be thanks to you. And thanks to Owen. Yeah. Great, Kelly. Ladies She's good at her job. Yes. <laughs> or perhaps the Lex Luthor stands accused of attempting to brainwash half of humanity into loving him and to murder the rest through evidence provided by Eve Tessmacher, who was present for every terrible moment, will prove him guilty of every charge. Well, I hope she does. <laughs> Though it's not gonna do anything, you know, because he's gonna you escape know, anyway, so... I fix it. Fix it right now! John, can I talk to you outside? Get it done. I don't immolate anyone. You're running yourselves ragged trying to get her back and speed up the process. Yeah. We've taken risks before. This mission calls for methodical planning without ego or emotion. But instead, you're just charging ahead without getting the lay of the land. You're, you're not acting like a soldier. You're acting like a father. I hear you, Wisdom Agon. I do. But we need to do this our way. You've been incredibly well, strong. Well, it works. I don't know. And then why did you cook me dinner? Because I was in love with you. And when I did not reciprocate. <laughs> Lino's face. I ask you, what is more reasonable? Or Eve Tessmacher, jilted lover, hell bent on revenge, setting up the man who would not have her, all to avoid punishment for her own crimes. She had the means, she had the motive, and she had an image induced. You made me hack obsidian. You made me do I all of it. Eve Tessmacher's testimony be stricken from the record and her plea deal revoked. Oh, uh, and if you'd be like throwing in a charge of perjury, that'd be cool too, Your Honor. But she was under him, like his control, you know. Oh my God, Lena! Yes, she looks amazing. Yes. Now I'm loving that dress. Favor, you want me to relinquish my shares and step down from the company so Mama's number one boy can retain his rightful crown. On the contrary, I'd like to sell you my shares. Why? Because Luther Corp in your brother's hands is nothing more than a weapon. Think of what you could do with all that power. You're trying to bribe me. Why in the world would I need to bribe my own daughter? Because you know I'm going to testify against Lex. An idiotic and childish notion. Eve's testimony was the backbone of this case. Now that Lex has completely damaged her credibility, all her evidence is tainted. It's fruit of the poisonous tree. If I don't speak to the brainwashing charges, then he might go free. So let him. Through cleverness and sheer force of will, he has convinced the jury that he's a good man framed by an evil woman. That perception is good for the entire family. The truth is good for the family. The truth is you did nothing to stop Lex until it was nearly too late. If you take that stand, you'll have to accept your guilt for every single thing you did by his side. And the Luther name will be as good as oh, worthless. I mean, I don't want to say she's Start right. It's time to do some actual good instead of just pretending to. Yeah. If I have to risk my name to make sure my brother stays behind bars forever, then I will. Lex won't hesitate to take you down with him. He knows better than anyone how to get under your skin. No, I'm counting on it. She's smart too. She can. Hey, she can do smart. I know it was. I know impossible it. to get. I give you my Phantom Zone simulation, meticulously crafted from all known data about the zone. Hidden somewhere in this simulation is my simulated Supergirl. Please, close your eyes. Try to divine her location. Try again. I could barely find you when you were dying on the Leviathan ship. I, mean, I thought maybe our relationship was what was clouding my powers, but maybe I just don't know what I'm doing. Without my mom or my sister, I don't have anyone to actually teach me how to interpret my dreams. And until I learn, I'm never going to be the hero I want to be. She's Kara. 
She is our beacon through the darkness. She's the example we all aspire to emulate. So yes, you may fear that you will fail to live up to Kara's example, but I am here to tell you in no uncertain terms that you are not a liability to this mission. You are the reason it's going to succeed. Yeah. You can do this! Come on, Mia. You got this. You got this. Let's try again. Okay. This is not good. So, while they're in there, they don't get attacked. Attacked. I take it you learned your lesson. I have to try again. Kara, I can't lose you again. Please, we can live safely here. I do what? Stare at cave walls day in and day out until time loses all meaning? You may think you are stronger than I, but strength doesn't matter here. The Phantom Zone isn't something you can fight. I can't beat it. But I am going to do everything I can to escape it. Even if it means I just get an inch further every day. But I would rather live through torture and do something than just exist for the sake of it. The House of L is meant for more yeah. than that. Totally. Well, I won't let my daughter go into the Hawks Mountain. So if you're going to insist on trying, I'm going with you. Good. Because this just existing... This testimony has been thrown out and the murder charge has been dropped. It doesn't so do anyone any good. Like, closing arguments? What? If there's it, no it has no meaning. I, actually, Your Honor, the people would like to call one more witness. What could one more witness possibly testify to? Oh, yes, baby. Honey, look at her. None the chariots. To do no harm. In, not, was in all her always glory. Always intention to make the world a better place, to inhibit our desires to hurt each other emotionally and physically. Lex corrupted my technology to turn every Obsidian user into his own mindless followers, essentially brainwashing them. To what end? To get away with murder. No further questions, Your Honor. Defense, your witness. Oh, God. This is going to be... <laughs> Something funny, Mr. Luther? Mm. My sister can couch her project in flowery language, make the world a better place. But put plainly, she created a tool to brainwash the masses. Isn't that right, sis? Yes, I did. But I wasn't the one with the motive to use it that way. Well, it's your word against mine on that. On, well, pretty much all of it, for that matter. Because in the trial phase, it became clear that Nanache was irreparably flawed. I abandoned it. But then how could I have possibly used your creation to brainwash anybody if that didn't really work? I said it was flawed, not that it didn't work. I was filing patents when you were in diapers. Why would I waste my time workshopping your faulty science fair project? Because your little sister had created something that you needed. Something that you could never have come up with on your own. You've never done anything on your own. You've always needed me. Objection! You can't stand that I don't need you anymore. Just they... Without me, your precious Nanno Cherry would have never gotten off the ground. So you think you can just take credit for my work? You're damn right I can! <laughs> I have always taken no. these things that you never would. But I supported you. Because you're a Luther. I can. It takes guts to wield power. 